Despite having won the battle, Ma Chao's alliance soon fell apart due to Cao Cao's scheming. Ma Chao was allowed to escape by joining with Zhang Lu. Afterwards, Cao Cao further consolidated his power in Hebei, but suffered a massive defeat at Qi Bi, leaving the balance of power in a delicate state. It was then that Liu Bei seized Jing province and then advanced on Yi in order to secure enough strength to challenge Cao Cao and Sun Quan. Yi's governor, Liu Zhang, pleaded for Zhang Lu's assistance, and Ma Chao was obligated to defend Yi against Liu Bei. Master Zhang Lu, you called for me. Our ally Liu Zhang is under attack. Go at once. By who? Liu Bei. Liu Bei? He of honor and virtue. That Liu Bei? You seem troubled. Surely you aren't forgetting the debt that you owe me. To think that you would go back on your good word. I will depart at once and defeat the army of Liu Bei. Additional enemy forces have been spotted moving this way! Chengdu is on the verge of collapse, and the enemy continues to press the attack. Did you seem unperturbed, Ma Chao? No matter how dire the circumstances, my sole duty is to protect Master Liu Zhang. <laughs> how valiant of you. It will be my pleasure to witness your prowess firsthand. And throw your heart into this fight! We fight for the generations yet to come! Master Liu Zhang, are you well? Hmm, reinforcements? I am in your death range for you. The enemy is hidden to the wrath of justice! Face me, I challenge you! I will grow stronger yet! Then, let us see what happens! I fight in the name of justice! I fight in the name of justice! Certainly live up to your reputation. Everyone else will crowd themselves.
like Wei Yang couldn't help himself. Ha! I can't let him have all the glory. I hope you are not satisfied with such a miserable performance. You bring shame upon the house of Master Zhang Lu. We must rouse ourselves for this fight! qualities still exist in this world. Hm. Defeating a single officer does not seem to change the tide of battle. Perhaps you lack the courage to probe deeper into enemy territory. This enemy wielded his spear with purity and skill. His lord must be one of great chivalry to command one such as he. The enemy is very strong. We are being forced back. Everybody to battle! Yeah. The men 
can't take much more. We must all back to the chaos. I fight in the name of justice. A true warrior indeed. You will carry our honor across the land. I am not for your head. I fight in the name of justice. I want the entire army to charge the enemy main camp. It will take nothing less than that to win the victory. I'll show you something. I fight in the name of justice. I fight in the name of justice. I shall withdraw for now. It was fortuitous that I was able to witness your might firsthand. I fight in the name of justice. We can't hold out any longer. For my people, for our future, I cannot do it. What does one as treacherous as you know of the future? Fight me now! Fight tomorrow! I fight in the name of justice! I fight in the name of justice! army has finally withdrawn and yet i felt something noble within liu bei i must learn more about him this victory shows the truth in our cause If I deliver your head to Cao Cao, my rule will be secure. 
Why, you little... How dare you! Run! I'll clear us a path! I should have known Zhang Lu had no honor. But where should I go? Liu Bei. Surely he's the one. <laughs>